play different. Greetings fellow Mac addicts. In this video, we're taking a look at With Open Eyes, images from the Art Institute of Chicago. This is another release from the Masters of Multimedia, the Voyager company, and we're looking at the Japanese Pippin version. So what is it? Well, as the title suggests, it's a collection of images of the exhibitions on display at the Art Institute of Chicago, each accompanied with a little bit of flavour audio which is a nice touch. It's not just pictures of course, you can also hear slash read a little bit about the art, although in this version it's all in Japanese. You can also see how big the piece is in the actual museum with humans in the image for scale, see where in the world it's from and find other pieces from the same place in the world, see what time it's from and find other pieces from the same time, take photos of the piece to keep in your scrapbook, get close up of different details and finally play a game based on each artwork. Unfortunately, the games are not very interesting at all. They are all very simple challenges such as spot the difference, jigsaw puzzles, connect the dots, picking the tool used to make a piece and so on. Not very engaging stuff. As for the images themselves, there is a lot here. It's actually a pretty great collection of art from the world and history, including some very famous pieces such as Van Gogh's bedroom and it made me wish I actually visited the place when I was in Chicago instead of eating a bad deep dish pizza. It was very very bad. So do I recommend this? Not really, no. For one, this only works on Pippin and secondly, this version is all in Japanese, so you're better off getting the Mac and English version which is much easier to find. And as nice as this collection is, you can also find all this information and more online now. It's definitely one of the better examples of this type of reference multimedia, but has become a bit obsolete in modern times. And that is with open eyes. Thank you for watching with your open eyes.